Hi! Science is fun and interesting. We investigate, explore, experiment, and discover lots of interesting facts. Good day, Science Natics! Welcome to Great Fun Science. I am Teacher Sharon, your science teacher. Come and join me in discovering and exploring the world of science. Only here at Breaka Princessa Dream TV. You had learned in your great three science that matter is anything that occupies space and has mass. It has three phases. The solid, liquid, and gas. For today's episode, we will deepen your understanding about matter. But first, let us be guided with the following learning objectives. Identify the physical properties of solid materials. Classify materials based on the properties they possess. Use the properties of materials whether they are useful or harmful. Get your pen and notebook and let us explore the world of matter. Let's have our Science Natics fun game. Are you all excited? Let's start! In this game, all you have to do is to write the correct letter of the answer of the following questions. Number 1. What characteristics of matter that make them distinct from one another? What is your answer? Is your answer letter D properties? Very good! Number 2. Which properties of matter allows the heat to pass through it? What is your answer? Correct! The answer is letter A. Conductivity. Number 3. Which material below is made of ceramics? The answer is letter C. Pots. Very good! Number 4. The lady was wearing her diamond earrings at the party last night. The rich gem added spark and beauty to her charm which got the attention of the people. What is the special property of diamond earrings? Is your answer letter D? Duster? Very good! Number 5. How can you describe the gases produced from burnt plastics? Is your answer letter C? Poisonous? You are correct! Very good! at the kitchen section of the department store. I can see a lot of things here. There are kitchen wares made of metal, made of wood, made of plastic, and made of glass. This is so interesting. This is a rice cooker. It uses electricity. Its bowl is made of metal just like aluminum and aluminum conducts heat this property of matter is called conductivity metal is the best conductor of heat another property
property of material is malleability. Now, what is malleability? Malleability is the property of material wherein it can be hammered into thin and flat sheets until a desired shape is obtained. Just like the bowl of the rice cooker, from an aluminum shape to a bowl. If you're not using the rice cooker to prevent damage of the cord, you can tie them using rubber bands. Rubber bands can be stretched and returned to its original shape. And that property of matter is called elasticity. As you can observe, the rice cooker bowl is made of aluminum. Why do you think so? Why not use wood, rubber, or plastic? Correct! Because these materials cannot be used under fire. These materials can be burned and melted when we place under the fire. Have you seen that? The map had absorbed the water on the floor. That was amazing! What happened to the water? Is that a magic? The map can hold liquid to a certain extent because it has plenty of spaces or pores through which liquid can be absorbed. And this property of matter is called porosity. Be careful when holding a glass. A glass can be easily broken into pieces when strong pressure is applied. This property of matter is called brittleness. Other properties of materials are luster. Luster is the ability to reflect light. Example is the diamond. Another is hardness. It is the ability of material to be rigid and resist pressure that may cause deformation or change in its shape. And the last one is magnetic. It is the ability to attract materials made of steel or iron. My dear Science Natics, it's activity time! All you have to do in our first activity is identify the physical property of the underlying material in the sentence below. Select your answer in the box and write your answer on your notebook. Are you ready? Let's begin! Question number one. A coconut number was used to construct houses. Is your answer hardness? Correct! Number 2 I have seen a reflection of light in your diamond ring. If your answer is luster, then you are correct! Number 3 A rock comb attracts tiny pieces of paper. Did you write magnetic? Then you are doing great! Number 4 A teapot made from ceramic was placed gently on the table. What is your answer for number 4? Very good! The answer is brittleness! Number 5 the metal spoon heats fast when soaked in hot water. Did you write conductivity? Then you are correct. Good job, children! For next activity, you are just going to classify the following materials inside the box based on the physical properties that they possess. Write your answer on your notebook.
Let's check if you got the correct answer. Plastic string and thin metal have flexibility property. Diamond and gold have luster property. Door latch and the jewelry locks have magnetic property. Flat iron and blower have electrical property. Casserole and frying pan have conductivity property. Did you get all the correct answer? That's great! These characteristics that make matter distinct from one another is called properties. It is classified as physical or chemical properties. Some of the properties of matter are malleability, elasticity, flexibility, luster, conductivity, electrical, magnetic, ductility, brittleness, and porosity which make these materials useful or harmful. Which material below is made of ceramics? What characteristics of matter that make them distinct from one another? The lady was wearing her diamond earrings at the party last night. The rich gem added spark and beauty to her charm, which got our attention. What is the special property of the diamond earrings? How can you describe the gases produced from burned plastics? Let's check if you got the correct answer. What is your answer for question number one? Did you answer letter A, conductivity? Correct! Conductivity is a property of matter which allows the flow of heat from one material to another. Just like metal. Metal is the best conductor of heat. What is your answer for question number two? Is your answer letter C, pots? Correct! Most of our pots are made of ceramics. What about for question number 3? Is your answer letter D, properties? Then your answer is correct! Property of matter makes each material distinct from one another. What is the answer for question number 4? Is your answer letter D, luster? Then you are correct. Luster is a property that reflects light. It makes the diamond shiny. What about for question number 5? What is your answer? Did you answer letter C, poisonous? You are correct. That is why we are discouraged to burn our plastic waste to prevent illnesses. There you have it, grade 5 pupils. I am very happy that you got all the correct answers. Good job! My dear science nuggets, I want you to list down five materials found at home and identify their properties. Write your answer on your assignment notebook. Thank you, my dear Science Natics, for another full of fun and interesting learning with me. This is again your teacher, Sharon, your science teacher. Always remember, science is fun and interesting. 
We investigate, explore, experiment, and discover lots of interesting facts. See you again next time on here at Puerto Princesa Dream TV.